Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. I greet you all in the name of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Still under the umbrella of Premier School of the Prophet. Today we are still looking at our, at our daily highlights. Dreams of vision with entrepreneurial application. If you see yourself with a keg um, or with a, a basin at the river or at the stream or, or at the top, at the top, a keg with at the top, and you are there to fetch water. And you open, you open the, you open the. You see the water. The water refuses to flow. That it it means that the enemy is blocking your blessing. You have to pray. It means something is blocking your blessing. You have to pray. On the other hand, if you open it and it's flowing, it's not coming out as it should. Or it's used to come out. You're not, you're not rushing out. You're just coming out as if the water is almost exhausted. It's also you have to pray. It means, you see, the enemy is slowing down your blessing. He doesn't want a full release. Okay? You have to pray that your blessing will be fully released to you. On the, and lastly, if the, if the water is flowing and it's flowing, it's flowing, I say congratulations. It means that your, your blessing is flowing. It's coming in abundance as it, as it should. Okay, now also, in another, it, this can happen. In another, let's assume you, you, after taking the water, you discover that the container, the water is, is leaking. As you are carrying the water, the water is leaking. Then you have to note that the enemy is leaking your blessing somewhere. You have to pray that the Lord will block every leakage in your life. Every leakage in your life. Everything that is making your, you to lose your blessing. That you not. You see, anything that is leaking your blessing, that is making your blessing to be eroding you. I mean, you are receiving, but you are not seeing what you are receiving. As if there is a hole in your pocket. Okay? You have to pray against that. God will block every leakage, everything that is taking your blessing. You see, after you have received it, you see, every waster. Okay? Because um, somebody said he had a dream. After feeling his, his keg, as it was going on, the thing was leaking. And before you know it, when he got to him, he got to him with little or nothing. In fact, I heard about one that he was going on just before he got to his destination. The water just poured up. Then he started praying that his effort will not be wasted. You see, that's wasted effort. You are coming with a keg, you are coming with a basin of water, and just before you got to your destination, everything just poured off. That's a wasted. If the enemy truncating or terminating your blessing, you have to pray against it. So take note of that. You go to the river or the stream or, or the tap or the well. And after filling your container, bucket, or, or keg, or whatever, and you carry the water safely to your destination or home, that is a blessing. It's a good one. It's a perfect one. Take note of this. God bless you. We'll see you again tomorrow. Receive the blessing of God. Our adventure.